Hi guys, it's Matt here with HeyPress8.10 and welcome to this really short tutorial on how to import a Minecraft world into Cinema 4D, alright? And this video is just a single video, but I'm going to be creating a whole Minecraft series this week on how to like animate, so stay tuned for that. So, if you want to go to Google and type in Mineways. And this is the program which you use, okay? There'll be a link in the description. Uh, you want to go download, download for your either PC or Mac. And then you want to go to your desktop. You, you need WinRAW to extract it, okay? Or WinZip. And then just click Extract to MineWiz. This will get it out of the uh, zip file. Okay? And uh, you want to open that up and click on that application, MineWiz. Like that. When the application opens up, you want to go to File, Open World, and just choose any world at all. Okay, and you want to find um, the spot where you want to put in a Cinema 4D, basically. So you can use the right mouse click to drag an area. So I'll just use this area, okay? Just click yes. You can change the maximum height because uh, it goes down to bedrock. So you can see all this time it doesn't make a difference until you get above ground. So just drag it to the lowest value you can get without it making a difference like that then it'll make it render quicker uh, so lastly you want to go to file export for rendering uh, just save that to your desktop tutorial it's out of Yorkshire there uh, save and leave all these the same and then you want to open this up in Cinema 4D um, scale 100 that's fine you want to zoom in, okay, as you can see, it's black and white now, it doesn't look like anything. You want to go to the first texture, highlight all of the textures, and when you're on the color channel, you want to go to texture, load image, and load tutorial RB, RGB, not RGBA, RGB, okay. Then you want to go to sampling and change it to none, and specular you can turn it off because it doesn't work very well with Minecraft animations. Uh, you want to check alpha and go to texture, load image and you don't pick the alpha channel, I mean the alpha uh, image, you pick RGBA and once again turn sampling to none. Okay, so that is how you get a Minecraft world into Cinema 4D. So I'll have a link in the description one to mine ways and two to the rest of the tutorials on how to animate the actual characters and light this world. So thanks for watching, hope this helped. As you can see on the video now, there's some of my other tutorials to check them out and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!